Good evening everyone and welcome to the Late Encounter update for 7th of December 2015. Uh, apologies about the lateness of getting the agenda up but just last night I just wasn't really up to doing anything. Um, and just couldn't get near a computer pretty much the entire entirety of Sunday. It was a shame because I managed to waste a lot of time playing games on Saturday. In hindsight, not a great idea. But there you go. Um, okay, as you probably saw, it's a very short agenda for this one. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube live and you're not seeing anything else, then uh, uh, then this is the very short agenda. Um, okay, I'm kind of stealing myself for this one because it's um, not going to go down too well. Uh, so, right. First thing, uh, is I'm going to say, there's no progress on this week again. I've been ill since... Uh, well, actually, a week ago today, really, um, I had a oh, good evening, Garzini. I had a medical procedure done on Friday, the week before last, um, that I probably mentioned on Monday as well, and it's just essentially knocked my body for six. I don't know what the hell's going on with it. I am bleeding from places I shouldn't be bleeding from, and not sleeping, and have waves of pain going through me. Uh, and it's been pretty much constant since last Friday, so I am. I'm not overly um, with it at the moment. Uh, I'm actually managing to get a bit of sleep at the moment, so I'm hoping that things are going to calm down a little bit. But it has kind of highlighted a few other things that are going on at the moment as well, so I'm going to go into that. Uh, the other thing is that sort of it's coming into December, Christmas is coming up. This is where uh, I'm kind of needed by family, especially my wife, to do the care side of things. Hi, Janice Geek. Um, so they, they, the time to myself kind of goes through the window at this time of year so I tend to get less than an hour maybe two hours if I'm lucky to myself to do things between having to go places, do stuff and so on <laughs> that's a love fest in the chat we, uh, and the family commitments are probably not likely to calm down until through into the new year so um, yeah, so that as well as at the minute I'm suffering from quite a lot of fatigue uh, as I say, this week has been particularly bad because I've not been sleeping through the night for a lot of different reasons, but even before that I've been kind of struggling to stay awake in the evening and stuff uh, Garzini, yeah I, I hope that everyone feels that way um, I just wish everyone did I know everyone doesn't in an internet community then everybody's going to be different opinions and so on but uh, I'm preempting something hopefully with with this broadcast. So uh, at the minute, as I say, there evenings and weekends, I am struggling, really struggling to stay awake in the evening. Um, today's slightly better because I've not been at work today, um, but generally, um, it's not great. So to the point, then, sort of push your foot around and tell you what I'm actually going to tell you. I made a decision today that I'm going to take a short break from RPG stuff and evening working and all that kind of stuff. Um, I get annual leave entitlement at work um, I don't get that for the RPG and it's kind of starting to show at the minute um, I think I've been kind of more or less non-stop for a year each other evening at the minute trying to get this stuff done and at the minute I just can't do it um, I'm going to be honest about it I have to have a break I need my evenings clear at the moment to try and get my head straight try and get family stuff sorted out try and get my health straight try and get this fatigue thing licked I'm also trying to drop the antidepressant tablets that I've been on for over a year and a half now um, get rid of that and get back on even keel with that and that's probably not going to help as I go through the transition um, I could do with the evenings to be able to get my head straight and get away from work and do what I need to do basically um, in amongst all that I will try and do what I can do as far as postal stuff um, essentially I'm going to take a break from writing completely uh, so the RPG is going to sit on the shelf for a little while um, probably about a month uh, I'm going to have a break until the Christmas and New Year period and all the shenanigans that goes along with it is out of the way um, hopefully you'll understand that and I just hope that you can have the faith that I will come back I will be back in a month I'm only asking for four weeks it's not a lot to ask well it's five weeks actually when I think about it but as I say I'll try and get the postal stuff done um, I'm struggling to get it done because um, the postage thing is just a pain in the arse 
Um, my post office around the corner from where I live has a tendency to sit on parcels that don't go in the post box. So they take them behind the counter, stick a sticker on them, and then I think he puts them in a box and then waits until he's got his box full and then posts it out. So I can't actually just take it around the corner to do it. What I need to do is get some time to get online postage sorted out, um, which then has to be posted the next day before the postage expires, which is a bit of a pain in the arse. Um, either that or start weighing and putting the right amount of stamps on stuff, which again means having to go and buy stamps from somewhere. It's not great, especially when I'm looking at international postage when it's not particularly clear how much it's going to be and all that kind of stuff. So that's the reason why I've been having some delays with the postage stuff. I just need to get my ducks in a row and try and get that sorted out as much as I can. So I apologise for those of you who are waiting for stuff, whether it be dice or pledge rewards or anything like that. Not pledge rewards. Um, whether it be dice or giveaway prizes, that type of stuff. It will get done. I just need to try and get the amount of time sorted out and get it sorted. I'm also not entirely sure whether this might be the right time to send them or not because I know there can be some problems with stuff going lost in the post at Christmas time. So there is part of me that's thinking it might be better to leave it until after Christmas to sort the postage stuff out now. Um, if you're waiting for something and you're uh, concerned about that then if you let me know I'll, I'll prioritise it I'll get it sent out anyway. Uh, so obviously there's going to be some, some opinions about this. Uh, there are some people on the RPG mailing list and Kickstarter mailing list who are going to have their negativity uh, and I understand your negativity I understand it and I sympathise however I am not going to let that sway me because at the end of the day I'm trying to do something that's going to give you a product that's going to be worth having and having a break at this point given the fact I've been unproductive for about three weeks now anyway I'm needing to take a break from it if I don't take a break from it I'm just going to start writing shit that just is crap and I'm not going to compromise it like that I'll use all the same reasons slash excuses that I always use for this kind of stuff. Um, but it has to be done. If you don't understand that, then hard lines. I'm asking you for your understanding and your patience until I sort certain things out this month and hopefully get back on the ball come the start of January. So um, There will be accusations of playing games. Um, how can I be playing games online if I'm streaming stuff? Um, which I have done a fair bit this weekend versus being able to work on something. Well, it's two totally different ballparks. Um, playing games doesn't work. It's not something I have to think about. I can sit in front of a computer and fly between planets and not really have to think about it. Um, I just listen to the music, listen to the, the lovely sounds that Elite Dangerous has or whatever game it is that I play and enjoy myself and immerse myself in something that helps me to chill out and hopefully get my head straight. So I will probably up the playing game time um, over this next month but then that's the nature of taking a break I'm taking a break so that I can unwind I can chill out I can get my head straight and if it needs me to go and play some games to do that then I hope you'll understand that I'll do that if I play online I play online if I stream I stream if I don't I don't um, I don't want people accusing me of wasting my time or whatever I'm doing it for a reason so if you don't like it there is a big frequently asked questions list on the website that you can take a look at um, otherwise live with it um, the delay again. It's, people are going to say oh, it's more delays and more delays and more delays. Well, this is essentially why I why, why I said to you initially that I'm not going to set a deadline for things. The Kickstarter does not require um, an ETA. It doesn't require an actual point of finishing or a finish date. Um, that's something that I provided or trying to, tried to provide as an additional thing, and it was obviously the wrong thing to do because I had no clue how much work it was going to be. Um, therefore it is a delay on top of a delay on top of a delay and again as I said I would rather take a break and get the creative juices back flowing again uh, rather than try and write something or put something out that's going to be absolutely shit because at the minute whenever I try and write something it just it's not right it's pants basically the way I'm going to say it so if I can't write I can't write that means I have to do something else so at the minute I'm going to do something to chill out, unplug my brain from uh, RPG stuff, unplug it from whatever else I call work when I'm at home and uh, have a bit of a have a bit of time off, have a bit of a laugh yay um, no I'm going to set a goal because I, I want to make sure that I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take this month off because this month is always difficult um, I think historically I've always taken a couple of weeks off at Christmas time, I can't actually remember that's how much time goes by but uh, I'm not going to um, I'm not going to leave it hanging. I will be back on the 11th of January to do an update. And as I say on the next page, 
the update on the 11th will be a non-progress. It will just be I'm back. Um, if I decide at that point that I'm going to take a little bit longer, then I'll take a little bit longer. And I hope again that you would uh, that you would understand that, understand why me with it, and support me with it. Otherwise, if I get too stressed out, then I'll have some kind of breakdown again, and you'll all you'll not get anything then. So, fuck you, Caleb Dark. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so that's essentially it. Um, I'll be back on work hopefully on the 11th of January and we'll get stuff sorted from then. Uh, lots, of, lots of stuff happening in between now and then, including Christmas and all that kind of festive shit that you all seem to like. So <laughs> we'll uh, be back on the 11th and then we'll get stuff uh, back on again. So as I say, Monday 11th of January next year. Um, I'd like to say to you all, I'm not going to do any video updates in between now and then. If you want to keep on, keep an eye on things or you want to see how I'm doing, then follow the uh, <laughs> follow the uh, the Twitch channel or follow the Facebook and YouTube stuff, and you'll find out when I get uh, videos online. And if you want to pop by and have a chat, then pop by and have a chat. You want to send me an email, send me an email. Just try and keep it positive. I'm not in the mood or frame of mind at the moment to take any sort of negative shit. Um, so I'll just ignore anything you post that's just criticised and stuff. And if I if I can delete it, I will delete it. I'm not giving a toss. Um, I'm doing this because I know it's the right thing to do for me. Um, and if you don't like it, then by all means, go fuck yourself. Uh, yeah, I'm aiming for before Star Citizen comes out and before the zombie apocalypse. So there you go. Hopefully that should be sometime before end of next year. Yay! Okay, on that rather negative note, I apologise for the fact that it's been such a, a, a negative Nelly. I apologise for the decision that I've had to make, but I understand I, I understand your feelings on it, which might which you might have. Um, and as I say, if you have any comments or criticisms to make, by all means make them, but keep them positive or keep them at least neutral. And you know, if you feel like being passive aggressive, then again, fuck you. I don't care. Uh, but until then, I, sh I hope you all have a Merry Christmas, um, a Happy Hanukkah, Happy whatever festive season you want to call it, and a Happy New Year, and I'll see you on the 11th. Um, otherwise, I'll see you on stream online whenever I pop round on different things. So, take care everyone. <laughs>